What's up, gals and pals? I'm Coach Vino. This is the Progress Bar, and in the spirit of the Christmas season, today I'm going to be making a delicious nutty fruitcake. Well, not exactly. I'm going to be making a tiki cocktail called Nutty Like a Fruitcake. So make sure you stick around, because we're going to boogie down. The Nutty Like a Fruitcake cocktail was created by Mindy Kukan at the Haley Paley in Portland, Oregon. All right, folks, so today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different for the channel, and that's making a tiki cocktail. But while I was looking for, uh, you know, Christmas-themed cocktails, I came across this one. I said, this sounds awfully delicious, All right, folks? So let us look at what is in the sauce. The first thing we're going to need is an ounce and a half of a Demerara rum. I'm going to be using El Dorado uh, eight, but you can use whatever it is you have in stock. All right, so there's an ounce and a half of a demo. Rah, rah, rah. All right, so the next thing we're going to do is a half an ounce of a spice rum. I'm going to be using old Captain Morgan because that is all I have in stock. I'm not a big spice rum guy, so I don't have the biggest collection of spice rums, um, and I don't even actually know too many, you know what I'm saying? So we're going to go with old reliable here. <laughs> Next thing we're gonna do is a half an ounce of a half an ounce of an orange an orange <laughs> an orange curacao, right, folks? So a half an ounce of uh, of an orange curacao. I'm gonna be using Pierre Ferrand, which is kind of like that workhorse there. You know what I'm saying? Kind of this this the uh, industry standard. There. All right, let me move my glass over here so it doesn't get lost in the mix there. And now we're gonna do a quarter ounce of an all-spice dram. Now, I do love me some all-spice dram. I mean, it is one of those uh, spirits that just really says, you know, it says holidays, you know what I'm saying? So a quarter ounce of all-spice dram right now. Next thing we're gonna do is three quarters an ounce of orgeat. All right, I'm gonna be using, uh, what's that, Libra & Co here, so three quarters an ounce. I am running pretty low here. I'm gonna have to restock really soon. I think I got just enough. Oh, look at that. Just enough, all right? So go ahead and put that there so we'll get all the drip out. The next thing we're gonna do now is we're gonna do one ounce of orange juice. I got some freshly squeezed orange juice here. It's already pre-poured, so we'll just go ahead and do that there. All right, and then we're gonna do uh, a half an ounce of a lemon juice, again, which I have here pre-squeeze, and then one dash of Angostura bitters. All right, one and two. I always like to throw the extra in there, you know what I'm saying? Plus, it's the holidays. You got to give yourself a little gift, give yourself some Angostura bitters. <laughs> all right, now what we're going to do is we're going to just uh, shake that up with a little bit of crushed ice, all right? So let me get, go ahead and get my crushed ice here, my Louis bag. If you're looking for a nice gift for someone this holiday, get themselves, uh, get them a Louis bag. It comes with a hammer. And you can beat the shot of some ice, all right? So let's go ahead and just put a little bit of ice in there to start things off, all right? And then we're gonna shake that for about uh, 10 to 15 seconds. All right, folks, I think we shook that bad boy up enough. Let's go ahead and get our glass out. You're gonna wanna serve this in a tiki glass if you got it. If you don't, just serve it in something nice and tall and festive or fun, you know what I'm trying to say? So we're gonna go ahead, we're actually gonna dirty dump this into the glass, all right? So let's go ahead and give that a nice dirty dump. All right, dirty dump. Dirty dump always sound a little uh, suggestive, don't it? <laughs> all right, so now we're just gonna top that off with some mice, fill it up real nice like. All right, again, we're gonna be using some crushed ice for this cocktail, all right? Let's just make sure we don't forget to use some crushed ice, all right? Oh yeah, there it is, folks. Look at that, that's pretty. It looks nice, you get the ice all over the place. It looks all artistic, you know, all the Instagrammable. <laughs> now we're gonna go ahead and garnish that with a little orange peel with some cloves that are stuck in there. We're gonna stuff that there. Let's make it look fancy, you know what I'm saying? We don't know too many fancy garnish, but today we might. All right, then we're gonna get a cinnamon stick. Look at that, a whole cinnamon stick. I mean, it is a tiki cocktail, so you gotta get a little crazy with it. And then, of course, we're gonna throw on a little tiki umbrella. And there you have it, folks, our nutty like a fruit cake cocktail. All right, so I don't know about you guys, but I'm absolutely ready to give this bad boy a sippy sip. Let's go ahead and put our straw into the uh, cocktail there. All right, and let's uh, see what it's all about. Cheers. Ah, it's delicious, guys. I mean, what can go wrong? I mean, it's got some amazing ingredients. I love that when you put all the ingredients together, the allspice still finds a way to come through and really add to that kind of, you know, festive Christmas flavor. 
it's refreshing, it's delicious, it has just the right amount of sweetness to it, and then, you know, the citrus comes in, it really kind of helps even things out and whatnot. The rums obviously add some beautiful vanilla notes to it. Um, this, is, this is just a nice little cocktail, folks. Very, very good. Mm. Well, look, if you're looking for a way to celebrate the Christmas season, while still, you know, pretending or fast or, or was it fantasizing that you're in the Caribbean somewhere or maybe out in the, you know, Hawaii, this is probably the cocktail for you folks, all right? So go ahead and give it a shot. If you like this video, please press like, please subscribe, and please share with your family and friends. Remember, sharing is caring, and when life gives you lemons, make yourself a cocktail. Cheers.